In the world of web development, JavaScript has traditionally been known as the language of the front end, bringing interactivity and dynamism to websites. However, with the advent of Node.js, JavaScript broke free from the confines of the browser and ventured into the realm of server-side programming. This opened up a world of possibilities, allowing developers to use a single language for both the front-end and back-end of their applications. Node.js is an open-source, cross-platform JavaScript runtime environment built on Chrome's V8 JavaScript engine. It enables developers to execute JavaScript code outside of a web browser, directly on a computer or server. This means that you can use JavaScript to build everything from command line tools and desktop applications to web servers and APIs. At the heart of Node.js lies its powerful module system. Modules are like building blocks of code that provide specific functionality. For instance, the file system module allows you to interact with files on your computer, while the HTTP module enables you to create web servers. These modules abstract away complex low-level operations, making it easier for developers to focus on building their applications. Creating a basic web server with Node.js is surprisingly simple. Using the HTTP module, you can listen for incoming requests on a specific port and send back responses. Here's a basic example. JavaScript const HTTP equal sign require HTTP const hostname equal sign 127.0.0.1 const port equal sign 3000 const server equal sign HTTP dot create server rec res equal sign res dot status code equal sign 200 res set header content type text plane res on n hello world server listen port hostname equal sign console dot log this code snippet creates a server that listens on port 3000. When you access http slash slash localhost 3000 slash in your browser, the server responds with a hello world message. This simple example demonstrates the power and elegance of node.js in creating server-side applications. While node.js provides the foundation for building web servers, it can be quite bare bones for creating complex applications. This is where Express.js comes in. Express.js is a minimal and flexible Node.js web application framework that provides a robust set of features for building web and mobile applications. One of the key benefits of Express.js is its ability to create REST APIs with ease. This makes it a popular choice among developers for building robust web applications. REST, or Representational State Transfer, is an architectural style for designing networked applications. It relies on a stateless, client-server communication protocol, usually HTTP. REST APIs use a set of standard HTTP methods such as JET, POST, PUT, and DELETE to interact with resources. These methods correspond to CRUD operations, create, read, update, and delete. Express.js provides a simple and intuitive way to define routes and handle these HTTP methods. This simplicity allows developers to quickly set up and manage their APIs. Middleware and routing are two fundamental concepts in Express.js. Middleware functions can be used for various tasks, enhancing the functionality of your application. Middleware functions act as intermediaries between incoming requests and the final route handler. They can modify the request and response objects or end the request response cycle. They have access to the request and response objects, allowing them to perform tasks such as logging, authentication, and data validation. This makes middleware a powerful tool in Express.js. Routing, on the other hand, defines how an application responds to client requests to specific endpoints, which are essentially URLs. Each route can have multiple handler functions. Here's an example of how to define a simple route in express.js dash, const express equal sign require, express, const app equal sign express. This sets up an express application, const port equal sign 3000. This line defines the port number where the server will listen for requests, app.get rec res equal sign. This line sets up a get root for the root URL, res.send hello from the homepage, app listen port equal sign console log server is running on port port this starts the server and listens for incoming requests on the specified port this code defines a route for the root url 
When a GET request is made to this URL, the callback function sends a hello from the home page message as a response. This simple example demonstrates how easy it is to set up routes and handle requests in Express.js, making it a powerful tool for web development. Section 3, Databases, the heart of your application. In the world of web development, data is king. It's the lifeblood that powers applications and drives user interactions. Whether it's user information, product details, or blog posts, almost every application needs a way to store and manage data efficiently and securely. This is where databases come into play, acting as the backbone of your application's data management. Databases provide a structured way to store and retrieve data, ensuring its integrity and consistency, which is crucial for maintaining reliable applications. There are two main types of databases, SQL and NoSQL, each with its own strengths and use cases. SQL databases like MySQL and PostgreSQL are relational databases that store data in tables with rows and columns, making them ideal for structured data. They are well suited for structured data and complex queries, providing robust support for transactions and data integrity. NoSQL databases on the other hand, provide a more flexible and scalable approach to data storage, accommodating the needs of modern applications. They store data in various formats such as documents, key value pairs, or graphs, making them suitable for handling large volumes of unstructured data and providing high performance. MongoDB is a popular NoSQL database known for its scalability and performance, widely used in many modern applications. It stores data in JSON-like documents, which makes it very flexible and easy to work with, especially for developers familiar with JavaScript. To interact with MongoDB from a Node.js application, we can use Mongoose, a powerful and elegant solution for managing data. Mongoose is an object data modeling ODM library for MongoDB and Node.js. It provides a schema-based solution to model your application data, making it easier to interact with your MongoDB database. Mongoose allows you to define schemas for your documents, validate data, and perform CRUD, create, read, update, delete operations with ease. Here's a basic example of how to connect to a MongoDB database and perform a CRUD operation using Mongoose JavaScript const mongoose equal sign require mongoose, mongoose.connect, mongodb, slash localhost 27017 my database, use new URL parser, true use unified topology true, const cat equal sign mongoose model, cat name string, const kitty equal sign new cat name zildjian kitty save, then equal sign console log meow. This code snippet connects to a MongoDB database, defines a simple schema for a cat model, creates a new cat document, and saves it to the database. Mongoose simplifies database interactions, allowing you to focus on building your application logic. Section 4. Authentication and Authorization – Securing Your Node.js Applications In today's interconnected world, security is paramount. With the increasing number of cyber threats, ensuring the security of your applications is more critical than ever. When building web applications, especially those that handle sensitive user data, it's crucial to implement robust authentication and authorization mechanisms. These mechanisms help protect user data and maintain the integrity of your application. Authentication is the process of verifying the identity of a user, ensuring that the person accessing the system is who they claim to be. While authorization determines what resources a user is allowed to access, defining their permissions and access levels within the application. JWT, JSON Web Token. Authentication has emerged as a popular and secure method for handling authentication in web applications. It provides a compact and self-contained way to transmit information securely. A JWT is a compact and self-contained way of securely transmitting information between parties as a JSON object. This method is efficient and widely adopted in modern web applications. It can be used to transmit information between different parties, ensuring that the data remains secure and unaltered during transmission. This information can be verified and trusted because it is digitally signed, providing an additional layer of security and trust. OAuth open authorization, is another widely used authorization framework that enables third-party applications to obtain limited access to user accounts on other services without exposing their passwords. This framework is essential for modern web applications. 
This is how you can use your Google or Facebook account to log in to other websites and applications, providing a seamless and secure login experience. Third-party logins, like those provided by Google, Facebook, and Twitter, offer a convenient and secure way for users to authenticate to your application. These services simplify the login process for users. These providers handle the complexities of user authentication, allowing you to focus on your application's core functionality. By offloading authentication to trusted providers, you can enhance security and user trust. By integrating with these services, you can streamline the user registration and login process, enhancing the user experience. This integration not only improves security but also makes your application more user-friendly and accessible. Section 5. Conclusion. Your journey into the world of back-end development. This journey into the world of back-end development with Node.js has provided a glimpse into the power and flexibility of this versatile technology. From creating basic web servers to building robust REST APIs and interacting with databases, Node.js empowers developers to build a wide range of applications. Remember that this is just the beginning. The world of back-end development is vast and constantly evolving. As you delve deeper into Node.js, you'll discover a vibrant ecosystem of frameworks, libraries, and tools designed to streamline your development process. Explore these resources, experiment with different approaches, and never stop learning. The possibilities are limitless.